Hello, and I'm going to be doing a video on the new Gears of War Judgment. I'm just going to be doing an online sort of gameplay of it. Quick match on Team Deathmatch. And we get straight into a game. As it is only, well, it got released today. I've been playing it for a bit, not a lot. I'm only, I think I'm rank 8. This is okay, not obviously amazing. But I have had all the other Gears of Wars prior to this one. And we have joined a, like, a fresh game. But we do have to wait for a... Is there actually any people in this game? Oh, no, it's alright. There's loads of people waiting to join, so it'll be alright. Right, please be my cue to get into the game. Please. 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 Nope, doesn't look like it was mine. Right, so we got Cole staring at the floor. It's clever of him. And Ty is now being killed. Yeah! Here we go. Right, I don't think I've ever played this map. So... No, oh, yeah, no, sorry, I have played this map. I just... I've never spawned. Well, that was a good start. Oh, what, he killed the guy, killed me, like, a split second after. Could have saved my life. I will remember that out. Yeah, you can, like, fall through stuff now, which is, well, fall down stuff now so which is a lot better right everyone seems to be up here so I can hear footsteps that way kill you it was only a computer so nothing to brag about and then we're gonna go down here lob a grenade there probably not gonna kill anyone because I completely misjudged it and there is someone going on this way, so I'm going to follow him. Hopefully he doesn't turn around, which he has done. But I got lucky and got him. Oh, there's someone that way. Going to lob a grenade, run over here. He's got, <laughs> he's got a sawn off and he's shooting me from there. We have a special kid here. We have a very special one here. Oh, it's because it was bad. A bot. Which makes sense. Oh, so if he kills me, I'm going to be so frustrated. Oh, I'm reloading. Please leave me alone. <laughs> Get down. I got three bullets. Come on, I need more bullets. Can there someone buy me a lob of grenade? Oh, I haven't got any more. But anyway, yeah, you, on this, you can't... Oh, boom shot, I'll take this. Run. But on this, you can't actually pick up frag grenades. You... You actually get to choose. Well, you can't actually pick up grenades. You get. You have to actually choose what grenades you want. I just get an easy kill here. Nice headshot. But yeah, you actually have to choose what type. Yeah, there's loads of different types, but you have to choose what grenades you want at the start. Kill coal. Why, why is it loads of computers? Is that all right? So they've got two computers, the rest of them are actual people. Uh, now we've got more people joining, which is good. So hopefully that'll fill, fill all the teams up. Oh, hello. Get down. But it's always funny on the first couple of days because you've got all the new people who've like never played Gears of War before and they're just running around like... That computer was doing with the sawn off, like shoot, trying to shoot you from miles away. It is quite funny. No grenade down there. There is someone down there. Wait until he jumps over. Oh, oh I got killed by a computer. Or spawn. But no, 
One thing I don't quite like about this is it's not down to... On previous gears, one team was the COG and one team was sort of the Locus. But it's completely changed on this. It is now one team is blue and one team is red. And so you could have two coals, one from red and one from blue. And so when you're in a sort of a big battle with loads of random people, it's kind of... I wouldn't say hard. No, we both killed each other. But it's it can get a bit confusing. You don't know who you're shooting at, really. Because it's just down to the armour. Which... Uh, it, you get used to it. But it's just... I don't know why they've really done it. On this one, instead of... And not... Oh, killed each other again. And not on the other ones. But yeah, they've changed a lot. A hell of a lot compared to last because as you can see I am actually not aiming and there is sort of an aim assist on there which is just obviously to make it a little bit easier which is alright I guess but sometimes you, the game is sort of it takes some skill sometimes to actually play the game they, it's not I don't like it really being like Call of Duty where everything's basically really easy to use. I like it having a bit of skill. Which Call of Duty's not really skill. You just run around. Now I'm being shot from behind. So I'm going to take cover quickly. Kill you. Right. He's going to get the boom up. Kill him. But you take cover now, right? I could, could I take out these two? Do I want to risk it? Why not? Just do this. Oh, yeah, bad idea going in. <laughs> oh well, I'm doing 16 to 5 at the moment, so it's not all bad. Oh, and then we just go in. Are they all leaving? No, they're not. We've got one from each team that I've got bots. Which is all right. All right, so if they're still in there, just throw a grenade. Should get a kill. No. Nope. Okay. Use my pistol. Oh. And to change. Oh, I didn't see you there. Yeah, I was trying to say to change weapon. It's no longer acting on the D-pad. I'm. Oh, what did I just do then? What did I just press? Oh, down on the D-pad. I didn't realise that. Is actually where you used to press. LB to sort of see through walls and check for guns. Now that's down on the D-pad. And to actually change weapons is actually Y. Which you can turn... Which, oh, grenade. Which you can actually only change your primary and a secondary we weapon now. Which is a little bit annoying. There's no sort of, you know, change over to your... Change over to like your... Um, oh, now I'm being shot again. Where am I being shot to? There you are. <laughs> and get the final kill ahead of me. Yeah, but as I was saying, you can't actually then press on the D-pad to choose what gun you actually want or what you actually want to use. It's just basically white. Did I get promoted on that game? No, I didn't. Which sucks. But that was a quite a good game. I had. I got. 19 to 6, 3 assists, got the highest score, but I think at the moment, I'm trying to leave this at the moment, there are actually only 4 game modes you can do at the moment, which sucks, so hopefully they'll bring out more, as well as it just get a bit boring, playing one all the time, it's team deathmatch, free for all, domination, and... I can't remember what it was called, but it's the one on the demo, which was all right. It wasn't that. It was. It was all right. It just got quite annoying sometimes, but it was still a bit of a laugh with your friends going around with your tickers. Yeah, overrun. That's what it's called. Overrun. So yeah, you got at the moment just four. Yeah, even on private, you can only select them four. So hopefully they'll bring out some more 
eventually, otherwise it will just get a bit boring. VIP and uh, players can sit online either in ranked match. Anyway, so I don't want to do that. Oh, you got all your characters. Um, have I just unlocked that one for my shotgun? I'll put that on for my shotgun. Oh, you got your people you can pick. I haven't unlocked these by the looks of things. Oh, I haven't done any campaign yet. I've just gone straight online. I might, depending on how, if I can be bothered to do it or not, I might do um campaign and then actually record it as well. Because normally I just do campaigns all on my own. Anyway, but I might record it. But yeah, these are all the people you can get on campaign. You got Aftermath, which is uh, a classic extension of Gears of War 3 storyline. You need 40 stars to unlock it. Okay, Judgment. Uh, cinematic story based campaign experience. You have zero stars. Oh, I have zero stars on each 40 to get that one. So I'm guessing you probably just have to sort of complete Judgment to get Aftermath. Okay, right, and you still got your survival there, for the people who did like survival. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. Um, please leave a like and subscribe. Subscribe for more. Um, I am thinking of doing some. I've done team deathmatch, but I am thinking of like doing domination three four and doing over and again. Um, and recording them ones. And seeing if you like them, so if you want to keep up to date with that, then please subscribe and thanks for watching.